What is up guys? Sword Saint Onion coming back at you with some more Elden Ring Shadow of the Erd Tree DLC. Look at that. That is this massive fucking tree, which I'm wondering if we're gonna be taking a hike up there. I, I'm wondering, I just don't know. Oh, our message was appraised. I wonder if it was our healing message and we're just gonna start getting stacked with healing notifications. Cause we did leave a heal and now I understand that's becoming like a thing, I guess. People just, you know, uh, <laughs> essentially, now I'm still spoiler free. I have no idea what's coming. I know we're gonna fight Mesmer um, at some point cause that's obvious. And I know there's that big dragon I'm guessing the dragon's gonna be here, and Mesmer is gonna be like here or here or. Um, this looks like a pretty major area, so possibly there. This, I'm just throwing predictions out. These are like finger, this looks like finger runes, and uh, there's these finger runes. We needed to, there's another one. We needed to ring a bell, so I'm guessing this and this relate. Um, and then there's also like this kind of middle section here, which we don't have any. Idea. So maybe me maybe the dragons here then or something. I don't I don't know. And there was also this sealed by Mikola. So we got a ways we got a ways to go, people. We still got a boss here. It looks like to fight. The dragon man was there. There's a dragon here. I hope we've been marking all the bosses. This guy, oh, that was the little dog that needs healing. That me messages said he requires healing. But anyway, uh, Dryleaf Dane is here. He will not talk to us. So we're gonna see if we clearing Morth runes will get him to want to speak to us. So that. Oh, you know what? I want to do one thing before we do anything. I want to talk to him since killing the lion. So he was where? He's in the storeroom. That's over here now. Oh, we can level up, it looks like. Beautiful. He's, he's having a hard time breathing. Now, we did talk to him. That's what he said, but I can't remember if that was before or after. Shit. Okay. Well, he's, he's in a bad, bad way right now. I'm really grateful they have the NPCs marked on the map. That's generally why I miss NPC quest lines, because I lose track of them. Like if you watch our Dark Souls uh, 1 playthrough, I, I don't know that we even completed any NPC quests, because I just lose them. I don't know, I mean, we could have went back and I mean, if we, yeah, if we would have taken our time like we are with Elden Ring, we probably could have done it. It's just I've beaten the game before, and I don't know. I was kind of on a time crunch. I don't really understand why I felt like I was on a time crunch. Oh, it looks like, is that a little minor camp? Oh, we already went up there. Okay, so more runes are this way. Anyway, I don't know. I'm pleased with the Dark Souls playthrough, but it wasn't as in-depth, quote-unquote, I guess, as I would like it have been. We, we beat every boss. Um, so, yeah. God damn, get the fuck over here. Lots of shades in the Morth runes. I hate the dogs. Okay, I'm playing really sluggishly right now. There's... 
quite a bit of bad guys here. And I've cornered myself? No. I've saved myself. There it is. Okay. Now we should be able to deal with the shades pretty easily. Because they slow. They slow, yet they worth a good amount of runes. Uh, okay, we want to head this way, yeah. Into the Morth runes. So Morth looks like it was similar to... Actually, I don't want to say that. Until I see more architecture. Similar to the Scorched Runes, I would say. Purple item there. There's a message there we should check. Underground ahead. Okay. I thought I saw an item over this way, though. Didn't I... Backstab. Didn't you drop something? Some rata fruit? Did I not see anything over here? I guess not. Let's check inside there for sure. So many butthole jokes. Wow! Okay, wait. Oh, that's going to take us down into this area. Neato. Okay, wow. So, uh, let's put a little player guy right there. Because we, what else did we want to check? So, I th I'm thinking this is going to take us to here. And this is going to take us to here. Let's f at least finish the Morth runes before we head down in either of those directions. Did I mark that? I did. Let's also mark this here. And it's been since yesterday morning, and I kind of forgot, like, I know I was like, next episode we'll do this and this and this, and I totally forgot what I said, so, um, yeah. Wait, was he was he pointing us to the underground or no? Regardless, we're gonna keep checking this place out a little bit. More under more. Okay, maybe this takes us down. Let's check this because there's a nice little item down there. Lucky I made that jump. String. It's pretty dark in here. Warrants our torch. So even the shade dogs drop the beast blood. Still want to check. Should we leave like a praise the research? We should definitely leave a praise the research message message somewhere. Next like kind of nook we find with no messages, we'll. Oh boy. Okay. So first off, left. I love that people will leave the um, first off which direction to go. Those are really good messages. I appreciate greatly the that so as a matter of fact we will do that so are we coming back to where we might have dropped down 
think so. Let's just remove this. Because we're headed in. Danger ahead. Definitely death. for defeating one by one. Oh! What do we have here? Oh, it's those uh, omen monks. But they're not called omen. I guess it would be horn scent. Oh boy. So while you guys are watching this right now, I don't know how timing's gonna work out, but oh, golden arcs, fucking cool. We haven't found enough new spells, I don't think. Releases a procession of golden arcs with a swing of the arm. Sorcery of the Inquisitors of the Tower wielded it as an incantation of the spiral. A swing of the arm releases a procession of golden arcs, charging enhances potency, the arcs resemble barbs, a known symbol of coercive questioning. The Inquisitors. That's So that's the new order of incantations we've encountered. So anyway, like I was saying, while you guys are watching this particular episode, I want to I wanna say, unless my timings are incorrect, um, I'll be in Italy. I'll be in Italy for a good p while. 10 days, 11 days or so. So I'm really looking forward to that. And I pre-recorded all of this content. For example, right now it is June 26th. And this should be going live about a month later. Doing one episode a day, Monday through Friday. So, yeah. Yeah, okay, buddy. These, the, the hidden path and then the liar. It's like, okay. Need help, therefore praise the message. All right, I'll, I'll give you a... See, let's see how many are. Does it only work if we're online? We haven't even gotten that one praised. Let's delete that one. We'll leave a different one somewhere else. This one hasn't really gotten much either. Snake? Snake! Oh, that's a Metal Gear Solid reference. Love it. Oh, that's one. That's a game I would love to play. That's one of my favorite games of all time. And I haven't played it in like years, so it would be so awesome. Well, I, that's a lie. That's a bold-faced lie. I started a new game, and I got just uh, past the first fight with... Uh, I don't want to spoil anything for those of you who haven't played it. The Cyborg Ninja. I won't say any more than that. Yes, we are indeed Bonnie Village. In the Bonnie Village, which is the new region, the lower region here. So this is a whole village here. That's cool. It looks like we got bridges to this over here. That could be like four episodes in itself, just getting to whatever this awesome thing is here. And then we got stuff over here, too. So, okay, Bonnie Village might be a little bit of a hub for us for the next time being. And then we still have this down here. 
Now that we got the Bonnie Village, this thing, should we go check what, what's this way? Um, let's do that. Let's do that. We lit the grace, right? Yes. I'm assuming Dryleaf is still not going to want to talk to us because we didn't really do much. We got that Inquisitor spell. Maybe he's an Inquisitor. Doesn't matter. I do want to do one thing real quick. We'll level up. We're going Endurance. We're thinking up our equip load, get better armor. You know, more stamina, more armor. We'll probably get Mind and Endurance to 20. I think I like the sound of that. Um, I want to take this off and I want to try at least once the, this thing. And then we can put on... Hmm. We never really tried this either. So let's try this one too. Okay, let's grab Torrent and ride to number two. It wasn't quick enough on the acquired materials. Ember of Mesmer. Hold up, hold up, hold up. To use for crafting items. Mainly found in Shadu Altus. Serpentine cord like ember. Uh, a remnant of Mesmer's flame, the symbol of the crusade. It continues to smolder as if crawling across the ground. What just felled that tree? Okay, we got a... Oh. Is something seriously fighting that dragon? Whoa. Perfumers. Is that a couple of those badass knights? Look at this. Oh my god. I wanna. I just kinda wanna observe this for a little bit. Look for items. It's another flame of mesmer. Like, are they gonna be able to kill this dragon? No way. No way. Damn it. Now we're in the boss fight, so I can't pull up my map. I can watch this epic music while these fools get mulched by this dragon, though. We got archers. Well, there's a purple item right there. Let's grab that while he's occupied. So they have to, they're all buffed. He's gonna, oh cool, repeating crossbow. He's gonna have to kill the perfumers, I think, before, oh. Let's see if we can get out of the boss fight, and then we'll, we're gonna have to go on like a dragon uh, killing run. Okay, so this just leads through to here. That's interesting, because I thought we were kind of stuck at... Okay, so wait. Let's move that. We'll put one of these. Probably about right there. Um, I thought when we... I don't remember the episode very well, but I thought when we came over here, we couldn't... Get to this part. Oh, see, yeah, we have rested at this grace. Did we just not notice there was a fucking hole right there? Typical. Now how do we get up top? Because that's probably, oh. Maybe we got up top already when we were, when we did the dungeon. Oh no, because look, there's a cross of Mikola right like there. Did I not mark it? Let's see, I'm looking directly at it. So 
So it's got to be like right here. Well, we got to figure out how to get up there. Possible, you know. Might have to get in there through this castle here. Which, by the way, we still have a boss to kill inside. Item ahead. Have we been over here? We have been over here, okay. We got that cross, yes. So we can't get over there. Let's. Now we cleared this castle before. We did not kill the boss. Oh, wait, let's check over here too. Which I, I believe we've probably already been over here as well if we've been around here. We just must have missed that hole. Oh yeah, this is where the fucking abductor. I wonder if these abductor virgins will take you somewhere. They do that in the base game. We'd have to maybe read, is there a message I think I saw? I really don't want to take on the fucking... Gotta read the message, gotta read the message. Uh, it didn't, I don't think it said anything about... It. Um, like, let it take you to a new place or let there be hidden area or something. So, we're very close to our runes, so we will go grab those real quick. Can't not get the mushroom. And fuck the message. Okay, let's um, go up into the castle itself. See if we can get up on top there and get that cross. Possible NPC position. Definitely, I would assume, a site of grace. Okay, hold on. What is this? Oh, that's the that's that grace outside. Uh, let's go from here. This is where the boss room is. Uh, we are on the upper portion. Oh, no, we're not. The cross was like, it's up there. Oh, it's even further. So wait. Is it like up there? No. Where is that? Where the fuck is that? I don't see any of my markers. That's not cool. It's gotta be up there. How do we get up there then? Maybe from this side then, guys. Let's uh, let's kind of plan that. Should we try to fight uh, Mr. Asshole that's in here? Where is he? Where's the boss room? Over here. What do we think, guys? Should we unleash, like, some swarms of flies on it? 
we can't bring in our buddy Andreas. Apparently we can't fucking dodge either. Let's just try and run past him and see what happens. I wonder if he drops a shot here. Come on up to this arena. This looks like a good place to do battle. Oh yeah. He still has a lot of health, guys. almost instantly after he has that stupid crucible move too. It's a slow fucking attack, guys. Oh my god, is he a motherfucker. Shit. Well, I'd like to see what's at least at the top of this tower here. He is quite the pain in the ass. What do they, anybody recommend anything? <laughs> Running and trying ladder. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do. It's got the tree sentinel fucking music. Where'd it go? Down there still. Yeah, let's just go see what's up here. Fuck it. Maybe he drops that awesome aspect of the crucible thing he was using on us. Down there? Battlefield Priest's cookbook. Oh no. No! I'd like him to kill himself, that'd be sweet. So we want to get... <laughs> God damn it. Oh, I just wanted to look around. Okay, that didn't work out so great. Hold on. That was probably a really loud noise. Sorry, I bumped the mic. Now, ugh, fuck. We were up there. Uh, I saw a tower, I thought. Where did I... Oh, that was probably over there. Man, I'd really like to get up there and get that cross. Anyway, we're going to move on. We will come back to kill this butthole. I'm, I don't feel like doing that right now. I'm more of a... More in a exploring mood. <clears throat> so let's explore Bonnie Village. Where's, how did we get in here? Through, uh, somewhere around here, right around here. So let's head right first and check that out. So this looks like uh, a pot village. It looks also like an, like the alien village. So I'm sure terrible things have happened here. Okay, 
so yes, there is a bridge over to there. So let's just really quickly mark that. Get off the pot. Oh, we didn't get our runes back. That's a shame. Now we're probably going to learn some terrible lore about these poor shades and feel awful and guilty about how many we've killed. <clears throat> Always good to get hefty crack pots. Totally want to do a new game plus pot run in my next run. That would be so fun. Uh oh. Uh oh. Greater potentate. Oh, it's a fucking beast. Never mind. Maybe I just missed the right spell. Don't you get cornered. Get me. Fuck out of the fucking corner, you moron. Real funny, Miyazaki. Real funny. Keep sharpening your blade. Just fucking hit the asshole for God's sake. God, there's a lot of them. Man. So potentate, I forgot. Doesn't the one pot friend say something about potentates? Bonnie butchering knife. Oh lord. What is that knife used for? Um, let's check the lore. The weapon of the greater potentates of Bonnie Village and outsized butchers could be used to dismember. Are you throwing rocks at me? Used to dismember human bodies in ma in the making of the great jars stored in the jails. That is, yeah, disturbing to say the least. A record of crafting techniques left by the devout battlefield priests. These keepers of the f of the faith fought bitterly to spread their gospel in the realm of shadow, where there was no Erd tree to gaze upon. So these are Erd tree faithful that are in the realm of shadow. Interesting. Mechanized crossbows are fitted with a fan-shaped contraption. This metallic piece adds a reloading system used in the execution of a unique battle art, the repeating fire. Key. Um, okay, we have a, another bridge, but it's out. But it looks like we can Go down there. Maybe get to the second half of the Bonnie Village. Oh, there's something in there. We got dogs. Something in incredible ahead. Cool. Living jar shard, living jar shard. Human bone shard. What do we got down there? Okay, we can ride torrent, so let's do that. Okay, yes, this is how we get up to the other side. Oh, 
But let's check what's in here first. Super dog. It's a fucking super dog, guys. Butthole. Ah. Beautiful. See, I like that item. I would say that is a good item. Fail. It's another super dog. Fuck. Okay, come on. Clearly the stab is not a good trap. Whoops. I think I just got that blue potion I wasted back. Where your dog, thank you. So human bodies dismembered to create the jars. Um, it's messed up. If that guy was meaning there was an item up here or what? He just said north. Oh, it's another fucking one of these guys. Okay. Those guys are mean. Yeah. They are nimble. Fuck. They are nimble. Okay, bridge. Bridges are always scary in the FromSoft experiences. Listen carefully, edge ahead. Let's see what I mean? Precious item ahead. This is north where that guy had originally pointed us for an item. Oh. I saw I saw the, the sword sticking out. Just in case, because if we die on the very last one of these assholes, I'm going to be real pissed off. Just kill him. For the fuck. For the love of fuck. I wonder if these are the dismembered. I wonder if these are all the. You know, the shades of the people who've been turned into jars. Living jars. Hefty crack pot in my inventory. Okay. So, we have bridge. Bridge number two. But let's check over to our left over here really quick.
Now we did hear mention somewhere of a special tree. Oh, mother gesture. Um, I wonder if that's going to be important somewhere. Necessary. Should I try the gesture right here? Oops. Um, oh, mother. Oh, mother. Let's think where else possibly it could come in handy for something. Okay, so it looks like a way down. That's not going to be till we get over to here, though. Okay, which bridge do we cross first, guys? Oh, is that... I saw some guidance. So, okay, this is just a small plateau. That's going to lead to there. Let's go check the this one first. From the uh, first side over here. Forty-two men. if there's any of those item pots hanging in disguise I'm sure they would stick out after you start looking for them All right, let's see what we got people it's rickety now have we been down there no we have not been down there at all Across the bridges and from soft games as fast as possible. So, wow, that's a pretty big forest area down there. Oh boy, we got scorpions. Is that a way down? Possibly a way down. Uh, actually, no, it does not look like a way down. But we might as well kill this butthole for sure. Give it a good shot with this uh, spell. Boom! Oh, you whore. Let's try one of our other new spells. Like this one. Oh yeah, that's cool. Does a good amount of damage. Now holding it increases the amount. And I wonder if they go through them too. Oh fuck, there's a second one? Jesus. Swords work. Swords work well. Okay, there is a cave going this way. Wow, there's a lot of scorpions here, guys. That's just a deer. Um, okay. What else was over here, though? Anything? Be wary of pack of scorpions. 
Great group. All right, so okay, this looks like a pathway through here. Well done. Thank you. All right. That's Dragon Peak. We've already got a thumbnail with the dr with the peak, but a jagged peak, excuse me. It's where we believe there's going to be a dragon. I mean, come on. We've heard that that's where his home is. Because Bale. What oh, do we have? A, a dungeon? Maybe just a precious item? Edge, butthole. So edging, I'm not really sure what that means, but it's got to be something sexual because there's edge messages everywhere. Um, okay, 46 minutes. Guys, we are not going to start a new dungeon with 10 minutes in an episode left. So I am going to end it here. <clears throat> and we are going to start the next episode and conquer this dungeon. Um, yeah. So, Sword Saint Onion saying buongiorno or buonasera or buona notte whenever you're watching this I am in Italy and I hope you're having a good summer because I sure as hell I am loving Shadow of the Earth Tree loved Tunic, loved Shadow of the Earth Tree beautiful beautiful alright, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe please Sword Saint Onion, 